Good afternoon, everybody, and, and thanks for coming. And I'd like to thank you all for coming. I'd like to thank the media. I'd like to thank our former players. It's just amazing. And legends who have come here today, our staff. Our staff was here, but most importantly, I'd like to thank all you, the fans. Thank you all for coming. Thank you. And, you know, as we look back at the spectrum, it's, it's bricks and mortars, but it's the fans who made the spectrum. It's the fans who created the memories and the family feeling that the spectrum had. And if you look back at the spectrum, we had many great moments. We had many, many great moments. We won Stanley Cups there, NBA championships. The greatest shot in the history of the NCAA basketball was at the Spectrum. The Grateful Dead were at the Spectrum 50 times. We all remember that funny smell out there in the Grateful Dead in that. It was a fun place. And I think the memories are so fantastic and the memories were created by these players. They created the memories but the fans created the family and the family feeling. And many of you who I've talked to over the years, they discuss how maybe they had their first date at the Spectrum. The first time they had a date, the Spectrum. Maybe they went to the circus as a family for the first time at the Spectrum. Uh, maybe a father took his son for the very first time to a flyer or a sixer game or a college basketball game. That was the Spectrum. And memories go on and on and on. And what we're here to do today is we're here to celebrate the memories of the Spectrum and how great a building that Spectrum really was. And it's important for all of us to have a good time today, enjoy ourselves, and reflect on how great the Spectrum was. And speaking of memories, the Spectrum had a couple voices. And there was very few of those voices, but one of the most important voices of our Spectrum was our longtime flyer announcer, Gene Hart. Gene was that special memory and voice at the Spectrum. And today with us is Lauren Hart, who will sing God Bless America.